Hi. We're going to be watching episode 20. What you see there is not Sasori's real body. Really? His real body is inside that one. Really? Inside? Okay. It's Sasori's specialty. Hiroko. Hiroko. You seem to know a lot about it, Lady Chio. Hmm. I know everything about that puppet. Well, good for us! But do you know how I prepare a new specimen for my collection? I don't think I want to know. First, I drain its blood. Then I remove all the organs and wash it inside and out. Make it nice and clean. Oh. And then, after I've preserved the body against decay, the final step is to fill it with hidden weapons. It's only one of the specimens in my collection. Collect? Once I've added you and the girl, I'll have collected exactly 300. This is my art. I was right. I did not want to know that. <laughs> Gara. Having one leg just sticking out of that bird is so disturbing to me. I don't know why. You know, my man Sasori is probably a more dangerous opponent than I am. Really? As much as I hate to say that. Mm. His idea of art is very different from mine. You can say that again. Long, long ago, when he lived in the hidden sand, he was esteemed as a master craftsman, mm -hmm. admired for his many extraordinary puppets. But his true passion was for making puppets out of the living. That's crazy! That's terrible! That puppet there, Hiruko, he was a shinobi who lived in a nearby village. Sasori turned him into what you see That's now. terrible! A puppet that retains the shell of its previous physical form. This puppet's highly skilled in attack and defense. Deadly at both. The first thing to do is find a way to force Sasori out of there. And how are we supposed to do that? Now that I've had a better look at it, this one is different in many ways from the Hiruko puppet I knew. Oh. Well, that's great. The Hiruko I used to know didn't have that shell on its back. And that left arm is new to me. Oh, great. So what do we do? If we are to defeat Sasori, we'll have to first destroy Hiruko. But that will require enormous destructive power that I simply don't have. Sakura has it! With all the training she's given you. Oh. So cool. You wield the monstrous strength of Lady Tsunade herself. You must somehow get close enough to use your monster strength to smash that puppet. Okay. And I'm guessing getting close isn't going to be as easy as it sounds. You can't risk even the slightest scratch. Because of the poison, mm. right? Exactly. As you know, the smallest cut can be fatal. So does that mean he's coated all of his traps and hidden mechanisms in the same poison? To survive, you must understand and instantly anticipate the Puppet Master's moves. Okay, how does one do that? <laughs> I'm not sure I'll be able to do either of those. Yes, it's true. This kind of challenge requires far more battle experience than what you possess. Mm -hmm. Take a good look at me, what do you see? Simply a worthless old bag of bones? Oh? Okay! Even his experience doesn't compare to mine. Wow. Sasori knows this, which explains why he hesitates and doesn't dare to attack us recklessly. For someone who hates to be kept waiting, it must be very frustrating. <laughs> what? Okay. Oh man, chill with the roast. Sakura, come a little closer. I'm going to tell you a secret. Sakura seems surprised by what she's hearing. Understood. Okay. Ready when you are. Are you sure? We'll end it quickly. Oh! You're doing a direct charge? <laughs> Ew.
Hold on! Whoa! How confident are you in that young girl and the old lady? You really think they're good enough to handle my man Sasori? You know what? Huh? I think so. Go on, Sensei! Don't worry! I'll take care of it! I'll save Zara! <laughs> Another direct charge. Um... The OST, oh my god. She's actually doing it, wow. I'm actually really surprised. Especially because she said that she didn't know she could do it. And all of them are dipped in poison. That's crazy. They were ready for that one, huh? In that case. Ooh, what is that? Oh my god! Now die! Oh no! She's dodging them! Is something going on here? Or is she just that skilled? I don't know. I love the music so much. They touched everyone. Impossible. The old hag, I can understand, but this... This girl... And Granny Chio's just... Just standing there. Why, though? Is this girl mocking me? Oh, God. The tail. What happened? What? Something stopped it. Of course. She What? Now, Sakura! What now! did she do? Strike it down! Right! There it is. Finally come out. I wonder eh? what he's gonna look like. Let me get a good look at you. I've come all this way to see you. Oh, oh my gosh, Granny Chio. <laughs> I've waited 20 years. I want to see my grandson's face. No! I'm really surprised that Sakura destroyed it in one episode. I thought this was gonna be like a multi-episode thing because, you know, anime. I'm wondering if when she pulled out her kunai and she attacked that first time, I'm wondering if she did something else to Sorcery's um, shell in order for that tail to stop or um, in order for them to dodge all of their attacks. It's very interesting. I want, I'm i hoping that they explain that. I'm really hyped for next episode and the continuation of the Sorcery Chio Sakura fight. It's, I think it's going to be really just epic. I love seeing Sakura in the limelight. I love seeing her actually, you know, contribute to a fight and I love seeing what uh, Granny Chio is capable of and, and I'm very excited to see what Saucery not only looks like but what he's able to do now that his real body is uh, out of the shell. I wonder what he's gonna attack with if it's uh, with more puppets or himself. I, I don't know it's gonna be I'm very excited. Um, yeah we didn't get to see Team Guy at all this episode so I wonder if we're going to see him next episode or whenever we're gonna see them because we haven't got that conclusion of those fights yet. And, um, you know, Daedra's still in the air. Uh, Naruto's kind of losing focus and getting a lot angrier than he should be. He should be calm collected, but it's Naruto, so can't really expect that from him. And Kakashi is doing his best <laughs> to protect him. Um, yeah, we haven't gotten any leeway on that fight as of yet. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited for uh, the next episode, the, probably next few episodes, honestly. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you liked, please leave a dislike. If you dislike, and tell me what I can do better. Please don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell so you're gonna find every single time I make a video. And I wish each and every single one of you a wonderful day, night, evening, afternoon, whatever you prefer. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye.